Life's not fair. Alley's Western, powerful toy. Life moves on. Grand trade car. Trade sign. The gate swings around the turn. There they go. Off stride. Grand train car. They're off and pacing. Life moves on. And Brian Sears fast out of the gate to the front. Life's not fair. Second. Racing up on the outside. Nail third. Powerful toy. He head of the turn. Fourth. Dream work. Pacing fifth. Alley's Western. Racing six, trade side, treading the field, Grand Trey Car as they race around the turn. Campbell moves to the front with Life's Not Fair. Racing second now. Life moves on, opening quarter 27 and 3. Into the lane, passing its end of the first time. Dream work races third. Alley's Western is fourth. Trade sign fifth. Racing six, powerful toy. The trailer is Grand Trey Car. He enter the turn and go on to the halfway point. Life's not fair. Has the lead for John Campbell by two. Racing second. Life moves on. Dream work. Pacing third. Alley's Western is fourth. Trade sign fifth. They're by the half. 56 and one. 28 and three. Second quarter. And here comes Mike Lachance and Dream work on the move on the outside. Followed by Alley's Western. Down the back side they go. Life's not fair with the lead. Life moves on second. Dream work on the outside third. Alley's Western fourth. Trade sign fifth. Moving on the outside. Powerful toy six. Treading the field. Grand trade car. Three quarters. 124 and two. 28 and one. Backside. A little more than an eighth of a mile to go. Life's not fair with the lead. Life moves on second. Up for a lightning lane. Alley's Western. The outside dream work. Down the stretch they come. Life, it's not fair. Drawing away. Alley's Western in the lightning lane. Coming to the wire. It's all. Life's not fair. Alley's Western second in 1.53. Big day for Campbell. That's four wins this afternoon. Into the winner's circle, the winner, the second division of the Adios. The Coors, Delvin Miller, Adios pace for the Orchids. Number two, Life's Not Fair. Jack Darling, Stables Limited of Ontario, and Daniel Smith of Ontario. Jack Darling, the trainer. John Campbell's fourth win of the afternoon. Three-year-old Colt, the life sign and a token gesture. Home winner in 153. Final half, 56 and four. Final quarter, 28 and three. And for life's not fair, that's four in a row at the Meadows. Chris Blaine, our marketing director of Trackside with the presentation to the owners, Daniel Smith and Jack Darling. Following the victory by life's not fair, winning the second division of the Adios in 153. Number two, Life's Not Fair. $2.80, 240 and 210. Thank you, Roger Houston. John, I don't want to say it's boring. It's never boring when you win, but it looked like almost a carbon copy of the last effort you got on the front uh, by the quarter and, and didn't have to look back. Yeah, both races uh, were quite similar. Um, you know, both of them were big favorite and I wanted to be in, on, in front with this cold as well. And, um, you know, he responded well. He's a big, strong-going colt, and I don't think two heats is going to bother him in the least. Uh, the effort in 153, a little bit uh, slower than the first one in 51 and 4, but uh, he's got a lot of uh, life left in the tank, I guess. I think so. He's, he's really a big, big, strong fella, and I think uh, the more heats he goes, the better he's going to get. John, they obviously, they both grabbed the track well, so no problems there. They obviously like the 5 ace mile surface. Yeah, ain't no stopping. It raced here uh, earlier and got around it real well, and this colt had no problem with it whatsoever. He, he handled well and, and was good on his gait and uh, did everything that I asked him to. I asked the same question I asked you just a little while ago. Was there any point that you were concerned at all, or were you very confident all the way around? No, he's a little more lazy on the front than the, the colt that I raced in the, in the previous race, but every time I spoke to him, he responded, and uh, you know, I was pretty confident again once I got the second quarter in. Uh, rather moderate and you know he, he felt real good from there on you went back and changed bikes 
Yeah, Jack uh, Darling was a little concerned that uh, he might hit the bike we were in, so we uh, changed to a different bike, and you know he certainly handled it well. All right, and then final question: You got a decision to make now. Uh, life's not fair, a winner, but also ain't no stopping him. Who do you go with? Uh, I'm going to go with ain't no stopping him. Uh, I'd raced him before at the Meadowlands and one thing or another, so I'm going to going to drive him. Okay. Seeing a little bit. You hope, huh? We hope. I hope so. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, John. Roger.